is increasingly things like how you're, how engaged are your employees? How well are you able to manage your succession plan? What, uh, what does your regulatory risk look like? How do you, how do you manage all of those things? And so, uh, my firm, Keiko Isom, is really set out to be that trusted business advisor uh, for producers and not just one service uh, or another. So. Um, that seeing the future, seeing the challenge, and then adapting and, and, and changing. So I think this is an incredibly important moment for the beef industry. There's a lot of focus on the gap between consumer trust and what key customers like restaurants and grocery stores say they need in terms of data in order to make that, that, that connection to consumers. And what does that burden put on producers? How do they respond? What we have found in working in this, in this industry for some time is that the beef industry, of course, has a very good story to tell. Um, but increasingly, it's not enough to just tell the story. Uh, it needs to be backed up with data, and it can be. And so a lot of what we're going to talk about today is really a, a, a communication and translation issue um, and not trying to push people to completely change the way they do, they do their business. So that's a little bit about why we're here and why, why we see this as an important moment. And I want to have Brad talk a little bit about uh, this from his perspective. Uh, a little bit about the Beef Cattle Institute. The Beef Cattle Institute is a cooperative arrangement where we have faculty from several different colleges that work together. And one of the reasons that, that we formed the Beef Cattle Institute is so that we can answer questions for the beef industry. And most questions that we, we receive are not in a single discipline. So we deal with questions and we answer them from a variety of aspects. So we have economists, nutritionists, animal scientists, other people that work to answer the questions so that we can give a holistic answer because that's what producers need. When both producers and veterinarians ask us questions from the field, they don't want just an answer that covers just one area. They want a complete answer. And so that's what, one of the things that we try to do. As part of our strategy and as we move forward as a Beef Cattle Institute, we want to be able to provide help for the beef industry, provide service for the beef industry to really move things forward. And that has a couple of facets. One, enabling communication. And I'd echo what Sarah said, that it's critical that we're able to communicate not just within the industry, which is really important, but between the industry and other facets. So be that to the consumer, be that to the purchaser, the packer, the quick service restaurant, or other areas, to be able to open those lines of communication.